Well, students with the Box Elder Job Corps are taking on a major renovation project, one that comes with a spectacular view. Tonight, Cutterland Sydney Thorson shows you their efforts to preserve an old fire lookout in the Black Hills National Forest. Although it's a hike to get up to the Custer Peak Fire Lookout, these students say it's worth it. Seth Ruff and Abdibaset Abdiwahab says it's a good mix of fun and hard work. A lot of work we've done in the past was just repair work. This is kind of like that, but on a bigger scale, you know. This structure was originally built in 1941. Since then, it served the same purpose for the National Forest Service as a lookout. What we're doing to the lookout is actually maintains its historic character. That, it, that it's going to look like it looked like when it was originally built. The National Forest Service teamed up with the Job Corps and Historic Corps on this renovation project, which will take about five weeks to complete. Hopefully, uh, they'll, you know, be inspired to go into historic preservation as well, because uh, we need more people to be doing that. Uh, a lot of these buildings are getting to be around 100 years old, and if we want to be able to keep using them in adaptive ways, uh, we're going to need people to have the construction skills who also have a passion for history. And so these students, like Ruff and Abdiwahab, can take this valuable experience with them in their futures. And then when we're done, we're going to do some construction in the future. I would really love to build houses in the future, you know, for people, custom houses and stuff. In the Black Hills, Sydney Thorson, Kelloland News. Altogether, the renovation should cost around $140,000.